and we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create a slant text effect. It depends on in which dimension or in which direction you want to slant it, but the process can be summed up like this. Let me create some text using the type tool. You can also press T for that. I press Ctrl A and now I resize it all. Maybe to 150. Let me select only the bottom part and I size that up as well. I want to have it somewhat as big as my first line. So maybe around 450, 440, that should be okay. You can adjust the distance between the lines right here. So usually it's set to zero when you start using GIMP. Let me go down maybe to one. 70 negative. You can obviously give it a different color right here. I want to stick to black for both lines. I'll put it somewhat in center and now I'll press Shift R to have to rotate to active. And also find it up here. So Shift R is the short key for it. You can adjust the angle right here and reposition the center point. You can also use the scale below it. I want to have a little bit of a negative value, like minus 15 or something. Confirm it via clicking on rotate. And now use the shear tool. You can also press Shift H for that. And you can shear it horizontally or vertically, but you cannot shear it at the same time in both dimensions. So if you would want to have both, shear it in the first dimension, confirm it, and then use this tool again. But I'm already fine with the result that I've got here. And this is how you can create this slant text in game. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.